Oh yes, the best in Irish and international talent celebrated St. Patrick's Day in style last night at the Meteor Ireland Music Awards and Ashling gave up her bank holiday blesser to hang out on the red carpet with all the stars. Oh! Tonight we're celebrating all those artists and musicians who had us humming along to their tunes last year. Yes, it's got to be the Meteor Music Awards and I'm here backstage at the RDS in Dublin to find out who made the biggest impact. If I had nothing but you want me to see, you keep your mind and take it all away. Enrique, you're very welcome to Ireland. You've just performed out there. This is crazy. I was just looking around. You've got like a million cameras in here. It is crazy and it's very, very hot in here too. It and you've hot. just actually managed to uh, raise the temperature. That Whoa, is, did you like thank that? Thank you. That's very nice of you. I think it's more you than me. <laughs> Stop the lights. So what were the uh, the crowd out there? What Those were they like? The Irish. What do you guys do? You know, it's, it's, um, I was saying in there in the press conference before that it reminds me a lot of Argentina or Mexico. It's that crazy, rowdy, good crowd that goes nuts. Keeping the show on the road for the night was the ever glamorous and former Ireland AM presenter, Amanda Byram. Have you had to do much practice to prepare for the presentation? You know, we had rehearsals yesterday and I hate rehearsals because there's nothing like the night itself. You know, if you're rehearsing, you're rehearsing to an empty room. So I was doing that, are you ready for a party? And there was one sound guy in the back that went, yeah. Welsh rockers the Stereophonics kicked off the proceedings with a medley of their hits. Quite an honour to open the show. Yeah. Who are you going to be catching up with tonight? To be honest, I don't even know who's here. Enrique Iglesias, apparently, is going to turn up. Have you heard he's a bit of a bad boy on people's blackberries? He pinches people's blackberries and sends naughty messages. You'll have to watch him. I haven't got a blackberry. <laughs> English singer-songwriter James Morrison accepted the award for Best International Male and told us what it was like working with Nelly Furtado on Broken Strings. That song is absolutely oh, wonderful. Yeah, we she's wicked. She's yeah. absolutely, uh, she's everything that I hoped she would be. She's really down to earth and funny and great singer. You know, when she gets in the studio and starts singing, it's, it's like Nelly Furtado, you know, it's weird. And from the Mercury to the Meteor, Mancunian group Elbow walked away with the award for Best International Band. You guys are on fire at the moment. You're just scooping up the awards and here's another one to add to the mantelpiece. Are you happy? Very, very happy, yeah. I, I've been asked to give more awards than we've ever received in the past, but it's all turned around in the last six months. <laughs> And well deserved too. So with the international winners out of the way, it's time to focus on the Irish acts that have impressed us the most. Yeah.